Whare. It is most appropriate that today we be discussing in the first reading of the electoral, uh, that we be discussing the electoral referendum bill. Many of us in this house today are wearing a red poppy in remembrance of the Anzac soldiers who have gone overseas to many wars to fight for the very rights that are underpinning um, the notion that this referendum bill is about. It is appropriate that we recall that they made sacrifices, many of them of their lives, and their families at home who anguished waiting for news of whether they will return. And they went with the notion that they were fighting for things like democracy, like constitutional integrity, like the right of equality in their homeland. In fact, in the 1930s, Sir Apira Nangata, a former National Party minister, wrote a very um, poignant essay called The Price of Citizenship, in which he was exhorting the establishment of the Māori Battalion and that if we wish to have the rights of citizenship in our country, we should also participate in the obligation of fighting for the integrity of our system in New Zealand. So it's appropriate that we should wear the poppy today and that we should go and spend Sunday commemorating um, not only those people who are part of the fa every family in New Zealand, but also of the particular principle of democracy that their valour and their commitment represented. Um, it is that um, today that we are also honouring the social contract that many New Zealanders understood to have been entered into when MMP was first passed as an electoral system in the mid-90s, that they would have the opportunity to review whether or not the system was serving, serving us well, was meeting our expectations. It's appropriate that we should honour, um, as our party um, does, the commitment we made at the 2008 election that we would conduct a referendum to see whether New Zealanders remain satisfied with this system and, if not, um, what other system they might wish to have that would protect their democracy and their democratic expression in um, the new century. And it is right that we should honour, as I said, those Anzac soldiers who all put their lives at risk such that we might maintain um, a democracy here in New Zealand. Like previous speakers, I too would like to commend the Minister uh, of Justice, the Honourable Simon Power, for the integrity that he has shown and the commitment he has shown um, to working across parties on an issue that really should not be driven by partisanship, but should be driven by our combined and unified interest in providing for our country a system in which all New Zealanders can enjoy confidence. And therefore, uh, Mr Speaker, I commend this bill to the House. Kia ora. Members, the question is that the motion be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. Aye. Contrary will say no. The ayes have it. Electoral referendum bill, first reading. The Honourable Simon Power. Mr Speaker, I move that the electoral referendum bill be considered by the Electoral Legislation Committee. The question is that the motion be agreed to. Those of that opinion will say aye. aye. Contrary will say no. The ayes have it. Call on government.